Yo guys, this is Reinhardt, and I was like capping my points last night, and I just want to give you a few examples of target calling on my DK. Now, our MMR is 2157, we're fighting a 2k team, so this is not the video to show how awesome I am or how high raid uh, battlegrounds I'm doing, but I just want to make it from an instructional point of view. So let's get started. After failing to kill the stroke down to 20-30k HP, I kinda realized that there's a lot of healing going on and we're not preventing a lot of healing because rogue should have died in that asphyxiate. I decided to go on a healers, so listen to me switch on a two different healers here. Let's get started. Uh can we get can we get another rest of rest of droids? Uh rest of shamans? Haxor? Follow me man, where are you? I need you. I'm on Haxor, Haxor, Papi and Axel. Haxor, Haxor, you see the others. Back. Nice cast bolt, nice cast bolt. Left some back. He's left, he's left, he's left, he's left. Nice. Uh, dude, I don't want to beam right now. The rogue is right here in the back. The rogue yes, is right here in the back. To scatter. He's open on me. The rogue open on me. Notice, guys, for this one, my boomkin said that he has a beam ready and he said where I want to put it. I said I don't want any beams at all right now because they're too scattered. And there's a reason for that because I like to think of myself as a decently uh, skilled person and I would not want to grip beam for sake of gripping look at the what enemy team does they are grip beaming right now who did they get they got two only two of us we could have done the same thing but needless to say it was not that effective because i would rather wait on the cooldown for another 10 15 20 seconds but make sure that we utilizing the cooldown to the max so that's the first thing i want you to pay attention the second one is going to be a hard switch to a monk healer. What I want you to pay attention with the card switch to a monk healer, how am I gonna actually communicate it, what am I gonna do, and how we're gonna get that kill. So I'm sorry for a little bit shaky for some reason, it is shaking a little bit. The very first thing I'm gonna tell you is, how did we communicate it? Uh, I asphyxiated the monk, and the mystery monk has a two second, um, sort of like a cloak of shadows, where all your skills are missed against him. So I stunned them and I said, get ready to get on the monk, wait, three, two, one, get a monk right now. And during that time, I saved my death runes and I applied all my death runes and all my necrotics on to the monk for the card swap so they couldn't pick him up. And then I had a soul reaper to seal the kill. So listen to me here right now. Hey, switch, switch to monk, switch to monk in three, two, switch him now, switch him now. So we're killing this monk and after that they're gonna be a huge and really good opportunity for us to beam and this is where I'm gonna yell out for the grip beam. So again, I did not want a grip beam just for sake of gripping and it was a really good call because I decided to hold off on that cooldown and right now when they're gonna be all clocked up, the boomkin is gonna be tranquility, this is where we're gonna do a grip beam and wipe them. Okay, I'm gonna do my try. Put, yeah, 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 put a beam, put a beam on boomkin, put a beam on boomkin, 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 beam, right now. Nice! Grip to everybody! Okay, everybody, everybody stop off. They should all die right here. Careful, careful, Reinhardt. Careful, Reinhardt. Um, okay. Should be fine. On the slug? Okay, we on got the them on the rash. We, we, should, we should try to hit the tank. We got it on the run. The, the tank is just kiting outside. Yes, of let's the go, let's go, let's go. Push in, push in. We're wiping the crap out of them. We're gonna push in right now onto the enemy graveyard. Well, the first thing I'm gonna tell you guys is. If you're pushing in onto the graveyard, you need to kill the healers first before you can kill FC. What a lot of DKs do, the big mistake, is they try the tunnel vision damage onto the flag carrier, and that is not a good thing to do because you won't die if there are three healers are healing him. So you need to kill the healers first. And I called out beam on the monk right now, and it's kind of failed. My boom can put it a little bit on the side, but we still actually got him. Take a look at here. You beam on the monk, oh, beam on the monk. I don't need it. Oh right my now. god. Beam on the monk. Is that your uh, beam? Sorry, Mir, come, 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 buddy. It's my beam, it's my beam. Yeah, they're right. fine. They're all in beam, they're all in beam. Bro. Run past the song, man. Okay, get on the shaman okay. tax. Get on the shaman tie, tax. Hey, rogue is no cloak, rogue. Stunning no him, full stop. Stunning faster. Yeah, dude, I got you, man. This leader is dominating. Silence one of the shamans. I'm gonna clone I'm tax. Don't it. touch tax. I'm gonna clone tax. Oh. Holy shit, he's not. Yo, get, okay, get monk, get monk. Switch a monk, switch a monk. He's cloned, he's cloned, the shaman talks is cloned. Get a monk, get a monk, 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 monk. Saving hugs? Monk. Okay, he, he bubbled, he bubbled, he bubbled. Perfect, the other guy is bubbled as well. Uh, DK, 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 right now, DK. DK, 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 DK. Locked him, locked it, locked hugs. DK. So rip on this DK, so rip on this DK, he's dying, he's dead. Okay, tax, 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 tax. Tax, shaman tax. Full silence on the shaman. 
Fuck. Kill's warding DK now, I mean, the FC, 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 FC That's, No, no, not FC, kill the killers, man. Yeah, FC, no, no, I'm, I'm, Okay, go FC, go FC now, go FC, go FC. Come on, come on, come on. I'm slowing in. Kill Hagdor, kill Hagdor. Beam, beam if you can here, nice. Gripping, gripping, gripping. Okay, shaman's down, shaman's down, monk's down. Okay, now FC, now FC. I'm running to the base, I'm running to the base. After that, we're gonna have a one really, really good, great fight, I would say. But unfortunately, after that, that the enemy team decides to leave, and we won with a 2-0, I believe, well, 3-0. Uh, but the thing I just wanted you to pay attention for the last minute is how the healers got upstairs to free cast, and I, how I actually told everybody to push in, not and to get on those healers to stop their free cast, I will grip beam them so they could get kills on those two healers but I would die in the process because my healers did not push in with me and I'm gonna call them idiots by the way for uh, trying to number uh, damage number pad by the way uh, for the DPSers while a lot of DPS didn't pull up with me while a lot of healers didn't pull up with me as well push in well I yelled out for a pushing in so the very first thing they need to do is the team needs to understand the decay they need to understand when he wants to push in and when he wants to get out I really like to play aggressive style I I'm a fucking Russian, I like to go go big or go home, I don't like the medium ground, so I really like to push in onto the enemy healers, and we did push in there and we did get a nice result. So in that sense, I want you to actually pay attention to the last fight, but after that guys, I think we're done with this instructional type of video, where you guys asked me for um, examples of me target calling, and I kind of brought you some examples, and I also reiterated those and telling you what exactly and how exactly I was calling them out and the reasoning behind them. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. As always, thanks everybody for watching and the Svidania. I'm on the Give other, the other shaman, shaman now. Shaman, shaman. Yeah, Chaos Bolt. like right in front of us. <coughs> okay. Hey, we found uh, the I think they need you on the on the front. Hagzar, 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 Hagzar. I'm pushing with you guys. Go, Shaman Hagzar, Shaman Hagzar. Shaman Hagzar. Beam on Hogzark Go, 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 beam, 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 beam now, beam now. I don't have beam, I don't have beam, I don't have beam. Doesn't matter, man, this shit Okay, tax, tax, shaman tax, so you see the monk. Silence, see the monk silence, silence, silence in bags, they're trying to carry okay, what was Sorry, here. I literally just got one shot at it. Holy shit, here. I really were, getting one shaman shot at Shaman tax, shaman tax, everybody, shaman tax. Get on that juicy beam, ass. <clears throat> I don't have Harold the Wild, but I have trying. I'm getting... So rip on him! Guys, shaman tax! Shaman tax! Shaman tax! Shaman tax! I'm gonna get it. Look that rogue, man! Where is the one on the rogue? Uh, I will kill rogue, don't clone him. I've beam, I've beam, I've beam, I've beam. Okay, wait for it, wait for it right now. Please, wait for it, because there's no point right now. We're not gonna get any killers. I'm gonna mark the rogue here, okay. the rogue is marked. Just bolting rogue. Actually, can you can we all push up, push up their killers free casting? Can we push it on the enemy killers and you can beam on tax? Can you beam on tax? Beam on tax, right now. Go, 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 He's dead. Go, go on talks. Go on talks. Everybody on talks. Everybody on talks. Still talks. Oh, I locked him. See, 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 see the other healer, dude. Come on. He's dead. Okay, kill the tank. 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 Thanks, dead. There you go. Okay, pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. I got four stacks. You guys gotta peel out and don't let anyone, anyone go. I'm on the, the base right now. Right next to you. Right next to you. 